I am home from the grocery store. I went to Wegmans. Wegmans is almost 30 minutes away from me, but I wanted to shop at Wegmans. Um, I'll show you guys the stuff that I got. I also bought reusable bags and it saved me so much time. Like I don't have a million grocery bags. I have four and I bought as many groceries as I usually do. Um, I got less meat than usual because I have a lot of meat in my freezer, but yeah. We're adulting so good this morning. Sorry, my camera gave me a big FU and stopped filming, but um, you guys saw most of it. Uh, you guys didn't see. I got some like pre-made meats, um, like pre-made food, like quesadillas, egg rolls, uh, pot stickers. I got some salmon cakes that are already made, and then I just bought some meat to cook. Not too much meat. Like I said, I already had some in my freezer, but yeah, let's go ahead and fill our cookie jars because... I've been slacking and I'm gonna do my menu too. You guys know I used to like really keep up with it. Um, I have like a menu of the food that I can cook, the food that I can snack on, stuff like that. So you don't have to stand in the fridge with your mouth wide open for 10 minutes. Like you can just look at the menu and you know what you have in the house, you know? <laughs> I am not even joking when I tell you the people in my life have been telling me to stop going to Zara. <laughs> like, they're telling me to stop. I'm obsessed right now because we're in a transitional period seasonally. Zara is putting everything in the store on sale. Not literally everything, but they're making room for like all the spring summer stuff that's going to start coming out. So, so much, it's like so much stuff, not even just winter stuff, but so many items are on sale. I've gotten so many clothes for Aurora. The kids sale is the best. Don't go online, go physically go to the store. The most expensive thing I got was $5.99. Everything's $9.99, $5.99. 2.99 jeans right now 2.99 paper bag jeans me and my best friend found yesterday at zara i have actually been this week four times and i'm not joking like i'm not just <laughs> that sounds so bad i'm not making that up you guys i'm dead serious i've been four times to zara this week i wanted to show you guys some jeans i got if you are a petite woman like me shop in the kids section i'm telling you it's gonna change your wardrobe my favorite puffer jacket is from zara kids and now I've been getting a ton of stuff from Zara Kids, but I want to show you this specifically. I'm not going to do like a whole Zara haul, but these jeans <clears throat> were $9.99. This is a kid's 13 to 14. I got some junk in the trunk, so that's the only problem. Like they fit my body, but my booty's big, you know, so that's like a little bit of a fitting problem, but they do fit. They're just very tight. Um, can't eat the day that I wear these. I'm just kidding um but yeah they have these like rhinestones going down the side they're studded they're so cute like so freaking cute it's a kid's slim fit 13 it doesn't help that it's slim fit either so they're really tight but it's 13 14 they're adorable comment down below what you guys think i should wear this with though i was thinking maybe like a plain black tight t-shirt like tied up in a like a little knot in the front I don't know. I'm going to look on Laylee Mirza. If you don't know her, I'll insert here. She's a luxury content YouTuber, like lifestyle vlogger. Um, and she wears the cutest outfits ever. I'm texting my boyfriend, sorry. I feel like she would be good inspiration for like what to wear because she wears like little pieces like that. But yeah, I am so excited. I might low key. I might go to Zara today because when me and my best friend were online at Zara yesterday, they were putting stuff out and I'm not joking. Like, I was looking in the cart like an employee had left the cart of stuff that had to go out. I was digging through it trying to find my size and something and I had to stop myself. I was like, this is ravenous behavior, like like a ferret. I'm acting like 
like a rodent than going through trash. It was so embarrassing. But yeah, I'm about to edit while Aurora is taking a nap. Let me tell you something. I took this little girl to the park earlier and when it was time to leave, she started yelling help. I was so embarrassed. I was so freaking embarrassed. I was like, she is not gonna sit here and yell help. And when she says help, it's really monotone. She goes, help help so i'm literally carrying her like like she's a small baby and she's kicking and screaming going help help i was like this is the most embarrassing thing my child has ever done to me ever wow Ta-da! She and person gonna do it every time. I love, I, I really, really love she and persons. On my way to Target, I need a pitcher and triple A batteries and nothing is going to derail me. I'm not going to buy a bunch of stuff I don't need. I might buy one or two things just for fun. Oh, I wanted to look at Five Below. Five Below has the cutest little like, like small home decor pillows like they're like really cute and funky i think i'm gonna look at five below too but yeah in target we're not going crazy we're not getting crazy we get what we need and we get in the out of there you know i just want like a regular picture and i can't find one this might be the closest thing but this is glass i, I don't think i want a glass one just because like what if Aurora tries to like go in the fridge or something I don't know but this one is like yeah I want a plastic pitcher I'm not having any luck right now I wish I had been paying more attention because look down here it's actually broken that little piece that little thing on the mat right there is from this and I would just ignore it but on the inside it literally like flakes off and it'll get into our drink so yeah at least i got batteries though i got batteries for the roku tv remote but this has to be returned i will take it tomorrow or the next day or the next day i don't know i <laughs> i'm a little lazy right now i'll take it when i have time because i don't feel like running back out i got my shoes off and everything i'm like too comfy in front of the bedroom door for a haul <laughs> okay i'm gonna show you guys literally not even half of my shein order but some of it is already in my closet. Some of it's in the dirty clothes. It's like way too much. So I'm just going to show you guys. Yeah. Aurora's behind the camera looking at me. Um, So I'm just going to show you guys some of the stuff that I got from Shein. I've gotten so many clothes lately from my boyfriend. I bought myself some stuff. The Zara sale has been going crazy. So I'm just going to show you guys some Shein stuff because there's so much stuff from my boyfriend and Zara. Yeah. And then the rest of my Shein clothes too. Like there's no way I could sit here and in this vlog fit in all my new clothes. Ah! This shirt is so cute. I wore it to the club. I'm trying to put it up. It's like the sleeves are detached but still attached. It's like half sleeves and it's completely see-through. It is literally so cute. I have this pullover hoodie that says it's not that serious on the back. I have this pink pullover sweater that zips in the front. It's giving very soccer mom and I actually really love it. I have this oatmeal nude colored bodysuit, so it's adorable. I have this pink long sleeve crop top, so cute with like baggy jeans. I have two of the same color of these pants. I have these gray ones, they're like, like fabric cargos. And then I have these tan ones in the same color. I do wish they were a little bit tighter um yeah yeah i wish they were a little bit tighter these jeans i have to stop myself from wearing every single day i'm actually obsessed with them uh this white t-shirt i made myself yeah i got bored at 12 a.m and i made it myself this long sleeve is like a hook and eye i think this is what they call it hook and eyelet shirt um and it's like corset style it's really cute it's unhooked right now but you'll see in the shein picture i got a pair of hey me kiss <laughs> thank you i got a pair of leather pants 
I got a pair of leather pants. I wish these fit a little bit tighter as well. I'm not sure if I'll actually wear them. And this shirt that I haven't worn yet, but I'm obsessed with. I, I just know it has to be a moment when I wear it. This is not even half of the stuff I got from Shein alone, let alone Zara, let alone the stuff my boyfriend got me on Valentine's Day. Like, I'm swimming in new clothes, so I'm gonna have to do a closet cleanup soon. Like, I literally have to. These are just the clothes that I haven't put away. Like, that's how many new clothes I have. These are just the clothes that I have to like hang up in my closet real quick. Ugh, wish me luck for this closet clean out. Okay, it's been a couple hours and I've done literally nothing. Like I've just been chilling. I took a small nap, like I slept for a few hours. I watched some Gordon Ramsay. If you don't know, I'm obsessed. I don't think I talk about that enough on here because he's a big part of my life. I'm obsessed with Gordon Ramsay. Anyways, um, I've been chilling. Y'all have never met my cat. I was about to show y'all my new tattoos, but y'all have never even met my kitty. Friends, meet Azula. Azula, these are my friends. She's the sweetest, little, cutest little mushkin in the whole world. She will never scratch, she'll never bite, she'll never do anything. Give mama a kiss, kiss. Give me a kiss, kiss. She's actually the sweetest. No, I'm not joking, she's the sweetest cat ever. So anytime you hear me say Azula, Zula, Zuli, Zula Mama, Zuli Baby, <laughs> Z Baby, any of that is Azula because she has so many nicknames. I didn't name her, she came, her name was Azula, and I was like, I'm going to rename her, but now Azula is just like so her, that's just who she is. But yeah, for Valentine's Day, one of my gifts was tattoos. My boyfriend told me, tell me what tattoos you want, and I got you. He's so sweet. But yeah, let's do a tattoo tour if you've seen my boyfriend before you also know that he's crazy tatted like face tats neck tats sleeves half sleeve he's like chest tats he's very very tatted so like that also is a thing for him so of course he would think to give me tattoos but yeah let's get into it we'll go through the order in which i got my tattoos first tattoo i cannot show you on camera it is on my booty like Brent Bias said, you know, she wanted a mine and she tattooed that ass. I wanted a butt tattoo forever. And then I wanted one on my 22nd birthday. And I had visited Maryland. It was before I lived here. And my mom was like, just do it. Stop being scary. Just do it. And so I didn't have my car because uh, I had rolled with my mom. Yeah. My mom took me back to her house to get my car. And then I, she was like, I'll hold Aurora. And she sent me by myself. She was like, it's, it was like cheap, like a $40 minimum. And I got a tiny little heart on my booty. She was like, go get it done. It'll be so cute. I was like, you really my dog, mom. I have to cover my third tattoo to show you my second. My second tattoo is the cancer symbol. It was done by a friend who's no longer a friend anymore. If you're watching this, F you. Um, <laughs> it's okay. If you look closely, the inside circle touches the outside circle on this one. It's not a huge deal. I probably will get it filled at one point and like fix it. Um, like fix it, it's not that bad. But yeah, that was a second tattoo and that was only a week from the first one. So I got my first one and seven or, I think it was eight days exactly. Cause I remember being like, damn, I, I waited a full week. Eight days exactly, I got that one done. Now moving on to the three tattoos I got gifted for Valentine's Day. The first one, why did this bad boy hurt? like hell first tattoo didn't hurt at all obviously because it's not really that area second tattoo didn't hurt at all this bad boy mm. if you know me maybe you don't know but if you know me i feel like you should know from like my social media and stuff my angel numbers are 111 and 222 especially 222 222 really resonates with me but both my angel numbers are 111 and 222 so on my right arm I got two, two, two. It is so adorable. I'm obsessed. I'm in love. Can't wait for it to fully heal and I can show it off. I can't wait for this summer with my arms out. And then on my left side, I got one, one, one. I need to put some Andy ointment on it. Aurora's bursting in the bathroom. But yeah, my left side, I got one, one, one. My right side, I got two, two, two. As you can see, the two, two, two is bigger than the one, one, one. And then third tattoo, it's such a hot girl tattoo to me. Like, I'm so bad. Uh, um, I got a tattoo behind my ear and I didn't get butterflies. Everybody does butterflies. I think it's cute and I hate it. I think it's adorable, especially Adeline Morin's. But I got a flaming heart behind my ear. 
and I'm obsessed. I'm in love. I'm in love. I think it's so adorable. I think it's so original for a behind the ear tattoo.